Hey, this is Sofago95. Welcome to tutorial number three. This time we're going to talk about nulls and the command mode. Now, first of all, mode is the command you can use to set the buffer and at the same time you actually set the the screen. So what you do, you do mode and then you do lines and rows. Anyway, it comes down to this. You first have the width. For example, you do 64, 32. Now this is not pixels. This is actually lines and rows. So let's try this. 64, 32. So as you can see, uh, here you have this. The screen is bigger than it was before. And then you can experiment with this to try to get a full screen, for example, which you do by doing uh, getting it higher. Now you will notice that some of them won't actually work. And also that if you make it bigger than your screen actually is, it will actually, if you have a second monitor, it will actually just go to your second monitor as well. And it will increase this the size of the scroll bar or the buffer thing so yeah if you don't want that just uh, make this one smaller as you can see now the scroll bar is gone there's only a scroll bar left here and now now we know the what the mode command does we're now going to talk about the null uh, basically what this is, is we're going to help this guy out. This guy's naked, so we don't want to see that. So All you do is this, and it will not display anything at the echo command. This is actually most commonly used at the pause command, because you don't want to have the pause uh, show up from time to time. This is the way you can actually make your own pause message so if I this is actually the pause message so you could say like pause message uh, press key to continue or something like that so that's where you use that for but of course if you use the null it won't won't display so you can use this for echo now this might seem useless at first if you use this for echo but there is actually a few uses for that uh, I will go later and in that in a minute so here you have the pause with a null you can actually change the null into anything you want it doesn't matter just do null for uh, so it makes sense basically so let's run this or save it first and run it as a in a dot bat file uh, oh god that looks stupid uh, so here we go we have the Hide me I'm naked is gone. It isn't dis displaying at all. And thanks, however, is displaying because it's not a null. And the pause was also not displaying. And it gave the pause message because I forgot to add the null here. So to finish this off, we'll just do this. And that's it actually for this tutorial. But before we go, I'm going to show you. Now the echo null actually doesn't really have a use uh, yet. But I am going to show you how to make this small little color changer. So what we have here, right here. Oh, oh. What we have right there is basically we're changing the background color. And every time there's a pause in between so it doesn't go way too fast. Uh, first it changes into A, B, C, D, E, F. F is the highest uh, from the letters. You could also do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 or whatever or 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, A, B, C, blah, 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 blah. So, what this will do is change the color without you having this stupid message. So, save, oh crap, save. And here you go. So, background color, change, 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 close. Okay, so this is it for this tutorial and I hope you liked it. Please comment if you have any questions about this. Leave a thumbs up if you liked this episode and please look at the description for the playlist or just subscribe. It doesn't matter. Uh, anyways, 
Bye.